Hey, what is going on guys? JT Judgment here and welcome back to another legend review in FIFA 15 Ultimate Team. Today we're going to be taking a look at the 89 rated Italian centre-back Fabio Cannavaro. Now, a lot of you guys have been requesting this review so I'm really happy to bring you this uh, you know, review on Cannavaro. I hope you guys enjoy it and I hope it doesn't disappoint basically because I know a lot of you are probably going to want to try this card out because looking at his stats guys, they are incredible. Moving into his in-game stats guys, looking at them for an 89 rated legend you'd think oh there's loads of yellow stats there's loads of red stats they really aren't the greatest but when you look at his defensive stats and the stats that are important for a defender they are ridiculous look at these guys 93 jumping 87 strength 89 reactions 88 interceptions 90 head in accuracy 93 marking 86 sliding tackle and 93 standing tackle for a center back guys those stats are absolutely incredible now quickly before i get into the review guys i want to give a massive shout out to the boy that let me use his account to do this review he has let me use his account to review a lot of legends and players in ultimate team this uh, this fifa so i want to give a massive shout out and a thank you to him a link is going to be down below in the description taking you to his account it would be absolutely awesome for you guys to head on over there show some support and say a massive thank you to him for that now going into you know the review of fabio cannavaro i know a lot of you guys are going to be asking jt is he worth it because i really don't want to use him because of his height a lot of people are going to want to you know avoid using him because he is only five foot nine and a lot of people including me like to have tall center backs you know the ideal center back would be someone who's tall someone who's strong someone who's got pace someone who's got good work rates you know the obvious stuff Fabio Cannavaro has pretty much everything you want in a defending uh, a defender I should say sorry apart from height when it comes to work rates he has the perfect work rates low attacking high defending when it comes to pace he's got pretty awesome pace in my opinion he's got 73 pace on the card but I've got to say guys he feels faster than that he was catching up to nearly everybody that tried to outpace him it was awesome maybe because he's short and he's maybe more agile that makes him feel a little bit quicker I don't know but he does not feel like 73 pace guys it felt like a little bit more than that for me defensively the boy was absolutely bloody insane sliding tackles it was incredible standing tackles were awesome with this guy marking interceptions it was just incredible defensively you're going to see a lot of clips in this video like i do with all the defenders that i do review and it will it, it'll show you exactly what the boy can do you know it's it's what he does every single game what else is there pace i've already mentioned strength position in all that fun stuff i gotta say aerial ability even though he is short he, his aerial ability was fantastic he is a center back that jumps bloody hell guys 10 feet in the air and there will be examples in this video he did it loads of times for me he would jump 10 feet in the air to win the ball and take the ball back for my team it was awesome so even though he is short he makes up for it by his jumping and uh, head and accuracy it is absolutely insane how high this boy jumps to win the ball like i said there's going to be examples showing you exactly what he can do in the clips his weak foot for me was pretty awesome now shooting in general with him was terrible but shooting isn't uh, you know a must for a center back so even though uh, it is a weakness i'm not going to count it uh, as a weakness towards his final rating because like i said shooting it really isn't important for a center back uh, but weak foot when it came to you know passing and stuff like that i had absolutely no problems with passing in general General is just insane with him absolutely fantastic distributing the ball to the midfield after making an insane interception it was just absolutely fantastic and starting plays and then ending up scoring from those plays he did it all the time for me it was absolutely fantastic now I didn't find any weaknesses other than his shooting but like I said shooting isn't a must for a center back so I'm not going to let it affect his rating guys I've got to give him a final score of 10 out of 10 this boy is absolutely incredible if you have the coins to spend on him guys i highly recommend you do so because this guy is easily one of the best legend defenders that i have used so far but as of right now guys cannavaro is easily one of my favorite center backs he's just absolutely insane don't let his height put you off because like i've already mentioned two or three times already he makes up for that with amazing jumping uh, and it's just insane guys the clips will show you exactly what he can do fantastic defense 
defender in all. That's going to wrap up this uh, review on Fabio Cannavaro, guys. I really do hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know in the comment section down below what you thought of him if you have used him. Leave a like if this did help you decide whether or not to buy him yourself. Subscribe today for more Legend reviews to come very soon. And as always from me, guys, please take care. And I will see you all next time. Ta-da, guys.